You can imagine that shooting also shaking up the A&M Commerce community about 20 miles from where all of this happened. CBS 11's Caroline Vandergrift talked to students on that campus today in Commerce who were at that party just hours before. Sundays are typically pretty quiet at Texas A&M Commerce, but this one feels different. Everybody is just in a down mindset and it's just sad to see. Many students have gone home to be with family. Others are sticking around to check in with friends on campus. We went from having the best homecoming to having one of the worst, and it's just, it's just, sad. It's just really sad. Students who went to the party say everyone was having a good time until shots rang out. So all of a sudden, you just hear pop, 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 just three shots. Yeah. Everybody just falls to the ground because, you know, nobody want to get hurt. Then chaos. A lot of people were getting stepped on, trampled on. In the rush to get out, people left behind shoes, jewelry, Halloween masks, all things we've seen here at the party venue today. The Hunt County Sheriff says one person was even seriously cut when they tried to escape through a window. I was just trying to run for my life. It was a lot of people like stepping on each other, people trying to find exits, and it was just really crazy. Now they're trying to process everything they saw and heard. But it was just very uh, surreal. Uh, you know, it's the kind of stuff you see in movies, so it's just uh, heartbreaking. Some think campus won't ever feel the same, even though the shooting happened nearly 20 miles away. I don't really feel safe, but tomorrow we have classes, so I have to be out. I can't just stay in my room. No choice but to move forward as they grieve. In Hunt County, Caroline Vandergriff, CBS 11 News.